now how much time you can give to god huh 24 by 7 into 365.4 you have to convert your life as a service i think that is what is required as you breathe for the body thus you can feel his aradhana all the 24 hours not necessarily 5 minutes not necessarily 15 minutes or half an hour or one hour or whatever it is every moment the life you can feel that is his service can you do it how many of you but my friends to have that feel you need the battery must keep charging because this is a battery our mind is a battery to charge it it takes a lot of time to discharge it takes no time <laughs> you know suddenly it falls down just like you know when the bp apparatus you must have seen that you know the doctor he pumps and then the mercury goes up and up and up but it takes a while to reach the up but when he screws it out and turns off that is our mind it falls with no, with no time but our duty is to recharge it at least for a moment every day charge it for 5 minutes or 10 minutes whatever you feel like charging and the energy that accumulated can be used the whole day throughout the day right that is what we call the puja don't think that puja means a flower which is here keeping in some other place water if from one cup dropping in other cup it's not the puja that is what we do in the form of puja right all flowers are here om kesavanamarana gundanam just we drop them there that means from place to place changing the placement and that's not the puja we want puja is something what you feel as a service as a beloved guest comes home and you do everything to him and then say are are i would have done a lot but i couldn't do this please pardon me you feel like doing more and more right does if you are able to feel him right in front of you and do whatever you can with your heart with your heart with your shraddha you have to do that that is puja but shraddha and love cannot be drained out cannot be picked up and offered you know just like a cup of water can you you need some cup to offer that love that is what you keep the material right in front of you all the material you have in fact this is not what god exactly is receiving do you think that is what god god needs your turmeric powder and kumkum and flowers and stuff like this do you think these are the things what god receives but you need this you know why if you want to offer your love you need a cup you need a container when a friend comes to your home and the friend never comes because he has no food in his home but when he comes home and you feel like honoring that friend with something so you prepare a cup of coffee and offer or you prepare some some prasadam and just you offer not that prasadam is not available in home to him but you feel like doing something 
and you offer it in a cup right you prepare wonderful chakra pongal and do you ask him hey come on keep your hand hot hot or do you ask him to open his mouth and just drop the coffee into his mouth you can't you need a cup in the cup you offer it depends upon if you are a normal guy you offer in a paper cup <laughs> but if you are you know just a well off person you may offer in a silver cup or maybe in a gold cup it depends upon how much you are concerned how you are placed you know that's how just you offer things to him to your friend and then what your friend has to do he has to take what you gave in this and return this glass back to you maybe it is a paper cup but he should return it maybe it is gold cup still he should return it to you do you allow if he after drinking if he keeps the gold cup in his pocket and goes huh? do you allow hey, come on keep the cup here <laughs> no matter whether it's a paper cup or gold cup he should return it to you <laughs> isn't it it's not the cup he has to eat it is something what you gave inside should eat or drink all right or wrong same way offer something to god you need a cup that is the flowers the fruits the the water the agarbatti dhoopa deepa naivedya everything is a kind of cup in which you fill up your shraddha and offer that's why anything you offered will be there only but the shraddha inside will be taken by him understand and he will not return empty cup he fill up his anugraha in it and gives it back to you so you change the name then it is a food before cooking but when you kept it in front of him the name is changed what do you call it why huh it is his divine vision filled up in that before that it is your ahankara filled in it you brought a fruit i brought a fruit i mine is this fruit you say that your i and mine you know in that that is ahankara but you kept before him he washes it out and he fills up his anugraha in that removing ahankara and filling up with his anugraha because it is coming back to you with anugraha and you change the name of that object this is prasada and when you eat it you are not eating the food now what are you eating prasada you know why because it gives prasadam prasadam means peace the word prasadam meaning of that word is peace his his grace always gives us peace what we call in equanimity that gives it gives that to us so when you eat it or when you drink his water that is used to wash his divine feet you call its name as teertha and when you drink it his anugraham is going into the stomach and his anugraham is entering the body that remains with you forever but whatever the food whatever the fruit whatever water you have taken anyway that goes in the form of waste that's not going to remain in you but the grace whatever you got through that remains in you that is why we do the puja so spare a few moments every day 
to recharge your battery, to recharge your thought process, to renew the thought, whatever it is you got as it is his temple, and then use it the whole day. You feel it everywhere. The process of recharging the mind, the battery, is what we call as puja. Should we start it now then? Is it right to light up the lamps here? We have the... Ah, oh, that is, oh. Mm -hmm. Okay, keep them on. <laughs> Hmm, that's okay. <laughs> it seems, I think probably all of you must be knowing the way. Uh, beneath this seems that there is a sticker. And you pull it out and then it glows. As if it's a lamp. Good. And do you have water with you? Amma? So we start the puja by doing achamanam. Achamanam is drinking water three times. But three times with mantra. Without mantra, it is only water drinking. With mantra, it becomes achamana. And before that, you need to know that you have to keep your hand this posture. Step one, thumb at the middle finger. Step two, index over the thumb. And rest of the fingers stretched and joined together. This is called Gokarana Mudra. In this posture, we take water and then we drink from the bottom. Some people drink from the middle. Some people drink from the fingertips, which is wrong. Water dropped from the fingertips, the energy goes to Devatas. When you take water from that little finger, that goes to rishis. And if the water taken from the thumb, it goes to Pitru Devatas, forefathers. But when water is taken from the bottom, that becomes Amruta. Brahmadhara, it is called. Amruta Dhara. So through Amruta Dhara, we drink the water. But two things you need to remember. While drinking, <sighs> No. No sound. <laughs> After drinking, what we have to do is a wrong practice. <laughs> By default, people say to the children, hey, put on head, put on head, as if it is a rule. It's a prohibited act. Don't swipe on the head. Because this is not a towel. <laughs> so, just you drink and that's fine. What we do is Achamanam. Three times with three names we drink the water. Let us do it first. Wash your hand with a little water now. First time, you have to say, Achamya, Achamya. Om Achyutaya Namaha, drink it. Second time, Om Anantaya Namaha, third time. Om Govind 
ಗೋವಿಂದಾಯ ನಮಃ ವಾಶ್ ಯುವರ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ನಾವು ಹಾತ್ ಧನಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ನಾವು ಆಫ್ಟರ್ ಟೇಕಿಂಗ್ ತ್ರೀ ಟೈಮ್ಸ್ ವಿತ್ ತ್ರೀ ಆಫ್ ಹಿಸ್ ಡಿವೈನ್ ನೇಮ್ಸ್ ವಿ ಟಚ್ ದ ಬಾಡಿ ವಿತ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ವ್ ನೇಮ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಫೀಲ್ ದ ಪ್ರೆಸೆನ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಲಾರ್ಡ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಬಾಡಿ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಆಸ್ ಐ ಸೆಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಟೆಂಪಲ್ ಫೀಲ್ ದ ಸ್ಯಾಂಟಿಟಿ ಆಫ್ ದ ಟೆಂಪಲ್ ವೆರ್ ಎವರ್ ವಿ ಟಚ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಫಾಲೋ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಆಲ್ ಆನ್ ಅವರ್ ರೈಟ್ ಸೈಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಆನ್ ದ ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ಸೈಡ್ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಈಸ್ ರೈಟ್ ಸೈಡ್ ಟು ಮೀ ಫಾರ್ ಯು ದಿಸ್ ಸೈಡ್ ಸೊ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ವಿತ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ ನೇಮ್ಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಆರ್ ವೆರಿ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ದ ವೈಟಲ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಬಾಡಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ವಿ ಮೇಕ್ ಇಟ್ ಎ ರಿಯಲ್ ಟೆಂಪಲ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಫಾಲೋ ಓಂ ಕೇಶವಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ನಾರಾಯಣಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಮಾಧವಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಗೋವಿಂದಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ವಿಷ್ಣವೇ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಮಧುಸೂದನಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ತ್ರಿವಿಕ್ರಮಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ವಾಮನಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಶ್ರೀಧರಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಹೃಷಿಕೇಶಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಪದ್ಮನಾಭಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ದಾಮೋದರಾಯ ನಮಃ ದ ಸ್ಯಾಂಟಿಫೈಂಗ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಬಾಡಿ ವಿತ್ ಹಿಸ್ ಡಿವೈನ್ ಟಚ್ ನಾವು ವಿ ಟೇಕ್ ದ ಸಂಕಲ್ಪ ಸಂಕಲ್ಪ ಈಸ್ ಜಾಯ್ನಿಂಗ್ ಅವರ್ ಥಾಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಡೀಡ್ ಟು ಸೇ ದಟ್ ವಿ ಆ್ಯಡ್ ಅವರ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಕೀಪ್ ಬೋತ್ ಆಫ್ ದೆಮ್ ಆನ್ ಯುವರ್ ರೈಟ್ ಥೈ ಕೀಪ್ ದ ರೈಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಅಪ್ ಕೀಪ್ ದ ರೈಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಅಪ್ ದಾಯಿನಿ ಗುಡ್ ನಾಮ ರಕ್ನಸ್ to keep them on your right thigh and we say three things now where we are when we are for what we are in the global positioning and following the lunar system lunar calendar okay let us say that shri govinda 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 ಶ್ರೀ ಮಹಾವಿಷ್ಣೋರಾಜ್ಞಯ ಪ್ರವರ್ತಮಾನ ಅದ್ರಹ್ಮಣ ದ್ವಿತೀಯ ಪರಾರ್ಥೆ ಶ್ರೀಶ್ವೇತವಾರಾಹಕಲ್ಪೆ ವೈವಸ್ವತಮನ್ವಂತರೆ ಕಲಿಯುಗೆ ಪ್ರಥಮ ಪಾದೆ ಅಮೆರಿಕಾ ದ್ವೀಪೆ ಸಿಯಾಟಿಲ್ ಮಹಾನಗರೆ ಭಗವನ್ ಮಂದಿರೆ ಭಗವನ್ ಮಂಡಪೆ ಭಗವತ್ ಭಾಗವತ ಆಚಾರ್ಯ ಸನ್ನಿಧೌ this is the placement the positioning you know in the universe we are here and now the time asmin vartamana asmin vartamana vyavaharika vyavaharika chandramanena chandramanena shri prabhavadi shri prabhavadi 
षष्टि संवत्सरा मध्ये श्रीखरनाम संवत्सरे दक्षिणा शरदृत पौर्णमाजमासे पौर्णम्या सुभतिध कुजवासरे उत्तराषाढ़ा नक्षत्रे शुभयोग शुभकर्ण एवं गुण विशेषण विशिष्टाया अम शुभतिध उत्तरा भाद्रा नक्षत्रे शुभयोग शुभकर्ण एवं गुण विशेषण विशिष्टाया शुभतिधम एन वाट पर्पस जस्ट हि सर्विस Just his service. Do his service. He gives everything. Bhagavat Bhagavata, Acharya, Kainkarya Rupena, Sri Rama, Ashtottara, Sata Nama Puja. करिष्ये टच द वाटर विथ युअर रिंग फिंगर राइट रिंग फिंगर रिंग फिंगर इज द लास्ट बट वन जस्ट टच द वाटर वन दट सो वाटर इज अवर ऑरिजिन अंडरस्टैंड Actually, from water we born. So whenever we chant one sankalpa, we touch the water. Thus we send it to God, and then He appears in our heart. From there we invite Him to the pratima that's given to you, the coin which we gave you. Keep it right in front of you. and first you have to feel him in you and then invite him there okay and invite him with all his subjects with all his parivara who are his parivara sita lakshmana hanuman bharata shatrughna that's all kanara all the people in ayodhya all the monkeys in the forest all the parivara of vibhishana in the lanka also all the devatas they are with him samasta parivaraya samasta parivaraya sarva divya mangala sarva divya mangala vigraha ya श्रीमते नारायणाय नम अध्यायामी फील हिज प्रेजेंस इन युअर हार्ट एंड देन इनवाइट हिम लाइक दिस आवाहयामी फ्रॉम युअर हार्ट यू आर इनवाइटिंग हिम टू द प्रतिमा रत्न सिंहासन समर्पयामी हि इज देर इन युअर हार्ट एंड हि इज देर इन द प्रतिम एज वेल सो इन द हार्ट यू कैन सी बट इन द प्रतिमा यू कैन सी सो डू समथिंग हियर 
whichever is available but feel something here whichever you can you can do ratna simhasana in your heart but physically you can offer a little kumkuma as his asana and do it arkhyam samarpayami take a little water with the flower and wash his hands but in your heart you can take a gold vessel a gold pot and you can bring the water from the from the river viraja and then you can offer right there is nothing you know stops you in making that in your heart physically of course you may not be able to do that but it's okay whatever you felt you feel in this and then offer it there padyam samarpayami padyam samarpayami wash his feet as well aachamaniyam samarpayami wash his mouth snanam samarpayami offer shower with hot water scented water in your heart but there with flower you can offer that plota vastram samarpayami take a the paper towel and pat him dry after the snanam vastra yugmam samarpayami offer beautiful clothes to them you can offer wonderful matching colors he is in blue color always what can you offer to him what kind of dress you can give him hello but mother with him she is always in golden color what a kind of color you can offer mm green green will be better you know and lakshmana swami he is white what a matching color for him any color any color blue blue pink red any color because is white any color matches urdhva pundran samarpayami urdhva pundram is tilakam on the forehead take kumkuma and offer him and if somebody is not having tilakam on their forehead those who are sitting next to them can watch and then offer to them also after offering to the lord yajnopavitam samarpayami yes you can offer a flower divya sri chandanam samarpayami you can take just a little the turmeric add with water and then offer it to him sarva bharana alankara samarpayami you can offer wonderful jewelry to him and not only to him but also to the mother and to all the following you can offer beautiful jewelry everything made of gold studded with the diamonds and rubies and jades and stuff you know in your heart you can create an offer right physically you may not be able to purchase all those stuff but in your heart you can make make them and now do namaskar 
just feel their presence in your heart once and see. And there, to their lotus feet, you can surrender yourself. Sri Raghavam Dasaradhatmajam Aprameyam Sita Patim Raghukulan Vaya Ratna Deepam Aja Nobahum Aravinda Dada Ayataksham Ramam Nishachara Vinasakaram Namami Santakaram Bhujagasayanam Padmanabham Suresham Vishwakaram Gagana Sadrusham Meghavarnam Subhangam Lakshmi Kantam Kamalanayanam Yogi Hrudhyanagamyam Vande Vishnum Bhavabhayaharam Sarva Lokai Kanatham Samasta Parivaraya Sarva Divya Mangala Vigrahaya Srimate Narayanaya Namaha Pushpai Pujayami Let us chant His Divine Names and in, in our heart try to create wonderful flowers. Every flower with a beautiful fragrance. Not like flowers without fragrance which we find here. But every flower with a beautiful fragrance, you create them with your love, they get fragrant. So you take something and show it here and create whatever you are able to in your heart and fill them in this and then offer things to his feet like this. You know, it's not the way to offer like this. Take something and offer. No. Pick, fill, offer. You know, if you offer uh, flowers, fine. Otherwise, you can offer uh, the turmeric, otherwise kumkum. Anything you offer, first show in your heart and fill up whatever it is you have they created and then offer it to the Lord who is there to receive. Okay? Om Kesavaya Namaha Om Narayanaya Namaha Om Madhavaya Namaha Om Govindaya Namaha Om Vishnave Namaha Om Madhusudanaya Namaha Om Trivikramaya Namaha Om Vamanaya Namaha Om Sridharaya Namaha Om Hrishikesaya Namaha Om Padmanabhaya Namaha Om Damodaraya Namaha Om Sankarshanaya Namaha Om Vasudevaya Namaha Om Pradyumnaya Namaha Om Aniruddhaya Namaha Om Purushottamaya Namaha Om Adhokshajaya Namaha Om Narasimhaya Namaha Om Achyutaya Namaha Om Janardhanaya Namaha Om Upendraya Namaha 
ओम हरये नमः ओम श्री कृष्णाय नमः दीज आर ट्वेंटी फोर द नेम्स ऑफ द व्यू हर्स ऑफ द लॉर्ड विच एंड देम बिफोर एनी पूजा and after this if you are really interested in doing so then you can chant the names of the lord and depending upon your commitment and interest it's not a rule that you have to offer these many in number number is not important but how you are concerned is important don't offer oh these many Okay, sir. Don't do that. Suppose if you have no time, just offer one and then go. Having time, offer at least twelve. No, Swami Ji, still we can offer more than twenty-four. No, no, still. Then one or eight. If you have still interest, then offer thousand eight. and still if you have then you can do lakshaarchana understand how many can you offer now tell me 10 20 how many you are able to now offer now sure yes shall we chant and offer come on Om Shri Ramaya Namaha Om Shri Ramaya Namaha Om Rama Bhadraya Namaha Om Rama Bhadraya Namaha Om Rama Chandraya Namaha Om Rama Chandraya Om Shashvataya Namaha Om Shashvataya Namaha Om Rajiva Lochanaya Namaha Om Rajiva Lochanaya Namaha Om Shri Mate Namaha ओम राजेन्द्राय नम ओम रघुपुंगवाय नम ओम जानकीवल्लभाय नम ओम जैत्राय नम ओम जितामित्राय नम ओम जनादनाय नम ओम विश्वामिप्रियाय नम ओम दाताय नम ओम शरणत्राणतत्पराय नम ओम वालिप्रमथनाय नम ओम वाग्मीने नम ओम सत्यवाचे नम ओम सत्य विक्रमाय नम ओम सत्यव्रताय नम ओम व्रतधराय नम ओम सदा हनुमदाश्रिताय नम ओम कौशलेय नम ओम खरध्वंसिने नम ओम विराधवध पंडिताय नम ओम विभीषण पिरात्रे नम ओम हर कोदंडखंडनाय नम ओम सप्तल प्रभेत्रे नम ओम दशग्रीव शिरोहराय नम ओम जामदग्निया महादर्प दड़नाय नम ओम ताटकांतकाय नम ओम वेदाताय नम ओम वेदात्मने नम ओम भवरोग से भेषजा नम ओम दूषण त्रिशिरोहंत्रे नम ओम 
ತ್ರಿಮೂರ್ತ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ತ್ರಿಗುಣಾತ್ಮಕ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ತ್ರಿವಿಕ್ರಮ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ತ್ರಿಲೋಕಾತ್ಮನೆ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಪುಣ್ಯಚಾರಿತ್ರಕೀರ್ತನಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ತ್ರಿಲೋಕರಕ್ಷಕ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಧನ್ವಿನೆ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ದಂಡಕಾರಣ್ಯಕರ್ತನಾಯ ನಮಃ ಅಹಲ್ಯ ಶಾಪಶಮನಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಪಿತೃಭಕ್ತ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ವರಪ್ರದ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಜಿತೇಂದ್ರಿಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಜಿತಕ್ರೋಧ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಜಿತಾಮಿತ್ರ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಜಗದ್ಗುರವೇ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ವೃಕ್ಷವಾನರ ಸಂಘಾತಿ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಚಿತ್ರಕೂಟ ಸಮಾಶ್ರೆಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಜಯಂತತ್ರಾಣವರದ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಸುಮಿತ್ರ ಪುತ್ರ ಸೇವಿತ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಸರ್ವೇವಾದಿ ದೇವಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಮೃತವಾನರ ಜೀವನಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಮಾಯಾಮಾರೀಚ ಹಂತ್ರೇ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಮಹಾದೇವಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಮಹಾಭುಜಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಸರ್ವೇವಸ್ತು ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಸೌಮ್ಯಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಣ್ಯಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಮುನಿ ಸಂಸ್ತುತಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಮಹಾಯೋಗಿ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಮಹೋದಾರ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಸುಗ್ರೀವೇಪ್ಸಿತ ರಾಜ್ಯದಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಸರ್ವಪುಣ್ಯ ಅಧಿಕ ಫಲ ಅಧಿಕ ಫಲಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಸ್ಮೃತ ಸರ್ವ ಅಘನಾಶನಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಆದಿಪುರುಷಾಯ ನಮಃ ಪುರುಷೋತ್ತಮಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಸ್ಮಿತವಕ್ತ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಮಿತಭಾಷಿಣೆ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಪೂರ್ವಭಾಷಿಣೆ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ರಾಘವಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಅನಂತಗುಣಗಂಭೀರ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಧೀರೋದಾತ್ತ ಗುಣೋತ್ತಮಾಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಮಾಯಾ ಮಾನುಷಚಾರಿತ್ರ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಮಹಾದೇವಾದಿಪೂಜಿತ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಸೇತುಕೃತೆ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಜಿತವಾರಾಶಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಸರ್ವತೀರ್ಥಮಯ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಹರೇ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಶ್ಯಾಮಾಂಗಾಯ ನಮಃ 
ओम सुंदराय नम ओम सूराय नम ओम पीतावास से नम ओम धनुर्धराय नम ओम सर्वयाधिपाय नम ओम यज्विने नम ओम जरामणवर्जिताय नम ओम विभीषण प्रतिष्ठात्रे नम ओम सर्वापगुणवर्जिताय नम ओम परमात्मने नम ओम परस्म ब्रह्मणे नम ओम सच्चिदानंद विग्रहाय नम ओम परंज्योतिषे नम ओम परम धाम नम ओम पराकाशाय नम ओम परात्पराय नम ओम परेशाय नम ओम पारगाय नम ओम पाराय नम ओम सर्वदेवात्मकाय नम ओम पराय नम ओम श्री सीतामचंद्र परब्रह्मणे नम ओम श्री महालक्ष्मे नम ओम श्री भूदेव नम ओम श्री नीलादेव नम ओम श्री अनंताय नम ओम श्री गरुडाय नम ओम श्री विश्वक्सेनाय नम ओम श्री पराकुशाय नम ओम श्री गरुडाय ओम श्रीमते राय नम 